Hello, this is Joseph from Gorilla 3D. Uh, I am the developer and designer. I actually do freelance, and this is just a simple little backend administration to a video game. And right now, I'm going to show a little introduction to my task manager that I've developed for it. Uh, right now, I have the username as Terror and passwords test, and I go ahead and log in. And oh, oh shoot. There we go. I'm going to log in, and now I'll get thrown to my task. Um, right now, I have a bunch of crap tasks in there, and the menu, documentation. And if you click, it'll actually show some documentation on it. It's a toggle link. Um, a suggest feature. Suggest something to me. It's a CSS window you can open and close. And then I have my pending t task and my completed task. Um, right now I have three pending tasks that are just crap, so I'm just going to click them and they get automatically thrown to my completed. This is all real time, so if I go ahead and refresh the page, I'll go ahead and show me my completed task because I already checked off. Now let's say that I want to go ahead and delete these three down here. Um, on my documentation, I have control plus click to remove a completed task. So hold control and click on them and they go ahead and, and remove permanently. So then if I refresh the page, they are gone. Now also these are just task titles. Um there's also task descriptions. If you click on the row of the task, it actually expands the task description. And to add a task, simply click add task another CSS pop-up window that I can move and close and I can assign this to myself or any other staff members um, put a title and put foo bar and my little description and go ahead and add the task the task is added in real time I can take away from pen and as complete it and add it back uh, and if I go ahead and refresh the page, it is there again. As completed, pending, and let's go ahead and remove this permanently. And it's removed. And that's the simple little task manager I've built so far. This is Joseph for Gorilla 3D.